Welcome to Wentz and Lucy channel. Today we are coming to Silicon Valley and I would like to introduce you guys a very unique different place to you. And I saw that I searched it from Airbnb, but really different things. So here we are now is Startup Embassy. Today we are going to meet the founder, Sergey, and have yes. a brief to you guys, what is a startup embassy? Hello, Sugei! Hey, Jonah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, thanks for doing this. And welcome, everybody. You're inside of our little startup embassy. We're here in the middle of Silicon Valley in Palo Alto, in, in literally the heart of. Uh, yeah, as I understand, Leia, it's kind of cold. We, we call it co-living space or co-working space. Even yeah. I know you guys are more focused on the community. Yeah. Yes. Would you like to uh, explain what what uh, what uh, initiation when the when you started this startup embassy and uh, what's your uh, goal for this place? Yeah, so actually, it, it's pretty funny story how this whole thing started, right? And and uh, at some uh. point they realized that there's so many people here who need that place, uh. right? And some people do it for themselves. But also, like sometimes you come in, it's your first day in Silicon Valley, you just don't know where to go, yeah. right? And if you have like you know fresh off the plane and you find a place that gives you everything you need and a company of people who will really become your friends later, right? That's just something that kind of like happened naturally, yeah, right? yeah, like naturally, not intended yeah. to do so. Oh, yeah, yeah, and then then you discover this there's a needs and I mean the demand, and, and now we've had over 1,500 ambassadors from 70 plus countries oh. in the world, right? Mm. And among them, we have companies who are really well known in Silicon Valley. They've raised a good amount of funding and those people are today in the cover of Forbes magazine or, you know, like people 30 out of 30 in yeah. Forbes. Yeah. Those are literally people who were here a couple of years ago, you know, cooking breakfast and, yeah. and hatching the ideas. Live like, together with yeah. you. It's an amazing experience, right? You met those people. Yeah, it feels like kind of, a, you know, I think like every day coming here, yeah. it you kind of sometimes get in a day to day and feel like you know it's kind of like a mundane job of like maintaining the house but if you obstruct and if you like look at a bigger picture you really are i think being here we feel like we're in the middle of making a future and making a history making a future, because yeah. every time every day there's somebody coming here and they have this big next idea and of course not every idea is going to work but some of them are working and, and that's really kind of heartening to see that and that all the people here is really with their own dreams so really inspiring themselves as well as inspire others. Yeah. So I think it's really like magic things. Yeah. And, and yeah, that, that's like I think that's the key, uh, one of the key things. But mm. right, we are not judging people on what sort yeah, of ideas yeah. they have, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And so we're trying to create this environment and community which is like specifically made for the people because right if you it's not that we don't want to open it to everybody but I think it's like those people have those specific needs. Yeah I know that you are some criteria for the investor, right? Yeah. Yeah so uh, so you will screen the people yeah. apply for yeah, people need to apply and then mm -hmm. we review every application you know, mm -hmm. after they, they, they pass it. Mm -hmm. It's not a difficult thing to pass it's not the same as applying to like, <laughs> Stanford or White yeah. Yeah. or Google, yeah. right? We know where everything was started. Um, and this is a place which welcomes entrepreneurs and founders from 
all over the world, we are the place that provides a really a residency and, and a sense of community. Uh, while all those people come here to build our companies and, and hopefully make uh, the next big thing.